So you start out. Okay, so this is going to be the temperature conversion from week two. Um, this is going to convert from the user is going to give you Fahrenheit or Celsius, and then you're going to convert it from that to the other one. <clears throat> so let's see, we start out declaring some variables. So we have a string called user char. Uh, that's just whatever they, whether they tell you uh, Fahrenheit or Celsius. And then a double for user temp, and then a double for the result, result temp. And let's see. Actually, that has to equal zero for now. And then you're just going to go uh, ask them uh, whether they want Celsius or Fahrenheit. Uh, or what they're starting with, I guess. And then just make sure they know to only enter F or C and not try to spell the whole word or anything. Okay, and then set the user character to the read line for whatever that was. So that gives you whatever they entered. And then after that, you ask uh, what the actual temperature is that they want to convert. So And then you just set user temp equal to the number that they give you. So equals, and you do a double dot parse to make sure it's a double. And then you're going to parse whatever the little, whatever they enter. So. that and then and then in case they enter a capital F or C just in case uh, they weren't paying attention you can set it to a lowercase so user char equals user char dot two lower And then set up some if statements. So if uh, if user char equals C, then result temp equals, and here's where you put in the uh, formula to convert, so like the Celsius to C to F or F to C, whatever. Um, for this one, it's user temp, so the temp they gave you, times 9 divided by, so times 9 fifths, fifths uh, plus 32. 
and then yeah, that's it for that one. And if they if user temp was not C, so else if it was or if user char was not C if instead it equaled F uh, then you would let's see yeah then you would just do the same thing like before but for F to C so result equals user temp. Actually, you need parentheses for this one. So user temp minus 32 times 5 ninths. And then just another else. Um, what was that? Uh, another else in case they enter something that's not F or C just tell them they messed up um, and just goodbye for now because we don't haven't done loops or anything yet, I guess. Um, there, and then at the very end, you do oh, come on. an output, uh, just saying what they what the result was. So, and then concatenate a little plus sign, and then just the variable name result temp plus period. Okay, let's see if it works. Starting with F or C, uh, let's say none of that. Oh, that's weird. Uh, so four should probably check those things before. Let's do it again. Do it the right way though. Starting with C, what temperature would you like to convert? Uh, let's do a hundred. So that should be like two hundred twelve. Yeah, 